In this video, I want to show you how the Parallel Inspector can help you developing your Parallel Instances or your Pilots. The Parallel Inspector is a free browser extension that at the moment is shipped for Google Chrome, Opera and Firefox. We'll have a look at the experience in all of these three browsers. Let's start here in Chrome. The Parallel Inspector has to be installed via the Chrome App Store. If you installed it successfully, you can find it in your Chrome extensions. In Opera, the situation is similar. Install the Parallel Inspector via Opera add-ons. You'll then see it in your extensions. For Firefox, make sure that you installed it via the official Mozilla add-ons page. If you have installed it successfully, you will also see it in your About add-ons page. Now let's have a look on how the extension is displayed. In Firefox, you get an additional tab in your developer tools. The tab is called Pyrel, and if you go there, you should see Not Connected. In Opera, you'll get an additional tab in your developer tools. The tab is called Pyrel, and if you use it, you're not connected. In Google Chrome, you'll also get an additional tab. This tab is called Pyrel, and also here, you should usually see a Not Connected. Now when you open a Pyrel instance that's currently in debug mode, suddenly the tab will be filled with a lot of information. You will see the name of the current Pyrel instance, its version, but you also see things like the available pilots and the registered routes. This view also allows you to remove pilots by simply clicking. It doesn't only remove a tile here, it really removes the full pilot. Looking at this page, you see that we have here a link towards the Bundesliga. Here is a tile with the Bundesliga. That comes from soccer sample. I can just remove this. Now if I want to bring it back, I just need to know the address. So using now an address of this pilot, I can just bring it back and I now loaded it as the last pilot. Likewise, I can use the URLs. All the URLs that are registered can be used. And if the URLs have some parameters, a dialog will open that allows you to enter the value for it. This is a great way to also ensure how your application is behaving if you type something invalid. For instance, using a not found URL here, we should get the page not found. In Firefox, the situation is the same. Let's try here loading a full feed. So I have entered the address that leads to the feed we used in the tutorials video series. We know that there is only a single pilot in there. It was called my pilot and here it is now. Finally, here in Opera, I want to demonstrate what happens if we just remove a pilot that we are currently using. Let's say we are at the news page that's coming from the news pilot. Just removing it will now be a page not found because we unregistered this page. We hope you enjoy using the Parallel Inspector. Any feedback welcome. Thanks.